Hello and welcome to Median Chat. Today I want to talk to you about the median house price in Melbourne over the last three years. As you know, I love the donut and I've been rigid about investing in the donut. Let's talk about house prices in the inner donut, which is the first five kilometres of the ring. So as you know from the CBD, the first ring out is about two kilometres. We're really looking at that five kilometre span outside of that first ring. According to the Real Estate Institute of Victoria, the medium house price today is 1.1650. Now, that's a colossal move in three years from $854,000 three years ago. Interestingly enough, the median unit price is now at $564,000. As you can see, it's rapidly chasing a three-year-old home price. My view is that the apartments are going to start to um, chase even more rapidly housing prices because as the houses are now over a million dollars, people are being forced to live in apartments. And it's really interesting because when I travel overseas to Rome, Paris, London, it doesn't really matter, Sydney, whatever suburb that you're in, whatever city you're in, inside of a major city, Generally speaking, it is dominated by apartments. If there's a house in the city or the surrounding areas, it's usually a consulate or some sort of commercial purpose built building. So I really think at this stage, with the medium unit price tracking now at $564,000, we're going to see a lot more people choosing that type of lifestyle. Coffee is up. If you look at the growth in the retail sector for the second quarter and third quarters, the growth was largely in cafe coffee on the move. And that's all about people downsizing their living and upsizing the coffee and meeting friends. My girlfriend in New York, for 11 years, her friends have never been to her home. They always meet in cafes. And I think we're going to see that sort of lifestyle flourish more and more in Melbourne. Anyway, enough for medium chat. Thanks again and see you next week.